So my grandma, who's 93, fell in her apartment and was taken by ambulance to a hospital. Um, she had cracked one of the vertebrae in her neck, but they weren't going to do anything with it. It was stable, um, but she wasn't safe to go home yet. So they kept her in the hospital, um, waiting to place her into a rehab facility, which was denied by her insurance. So they sent her home after a week in the hospital. And then less than 24 hours later, she fell again. Honestly, I'm horrified at the care that she got. Uh, she really didn't get care. Um, you know, for, for them to come in when I would hit the button to ask a question or talk about the plan of care. And I could tell they were just so hurried. They, you know, they were prioritizing their care and she was not a priority. She was waiting for placement, you know. She didn't have any pressing medical concerns or treatments that needed to be done. Um, and so she really, really suffered just in like the basic necessities of, you know, managing her diabetes, getting up and walking. She couldn't do getting to the bathroom. She couldn't do getting showered. She didn't get a shower. You know, it, it was very clear to me that the nurses wanted to be in there. But every time they came in, it took a long time to answer the call light. They were very hurried. Um, really over what they just seemed overwhelmed like there was somewhere else that they had to be the the standard of care has fallen so far from where it used to be um, the resources are being stripped away we don't there aren't like the basic resources that the nurses need to take care of the patients are disappearing